brief a new King James Version and re-examine yourself as to whether you are in the faith. Test yourself. Do you not know yourself that Jesus Christ is in you unless indeed you are disqualified? My message to you is, it's time to know who you are in God. It's time to know who you are in God or in Jesus Christ. It's time to know who you are. When Paul was writing this, Paul was telling the Corinthian church, it's time to take an inventory of yourself. It's time to know where you stand. Stand with God. Lamentation, uh, uh, third chapter, verse number 40, read, Let us examine and test our ways and turn back to the Lord. My friend, in a time like this, with this coronavirus, it's time to know where you stand with God. If you don't know where you stand with God, you're going to fall into the snares of the devil. You're going to fall in catching the coronavirus and die, and then you go straight to hell. So I'm telling you today, my friend, it's time to know who you are. In John, in John 6, chapter verse 6, say, But he was asking this to test him, for he knew what he was about to do so i'm telling you that listen to this video my friend you might can't see me glory to god but god can see you it's time to know who you are in god are you a christian christians just don't depend on a building but but christian depend on christ the bible say how how paul hallelujah say we gotta examine ourselves whether you are in the faith not fear, not being haunted, hallelujah, not being cowards. It's time to know who you are in God because, my friend, you ain't got nobody to encourage you now. Paul say, glory to God, examine yourself. David, when David lost almost everything, David say, I encourage myself in the Lord. It's time to know who you are. My friend, nobody has to validate who you are. My friend, you should know if you're a Christian or you're just a church goer. It's time to know that you are a Christian. A Christian, my friend, go to God. They have faith in God. Church goers, they fear God. Church goers are fame and they are not followers. Christians are followers of Jesus Christ. They're not just fan. What is a fan? A fan is stand on the fence and cheer. A fan is a fan when it's called altar call. My friend, they're ready to put their thing up and go to the bathroom because they said, I'm not ready to let go of the world. But it's time, my friend, to know who you are. I've been preaching this message for a long time, and I'm going to stick on it, my friend. You are a Christian if you decide to lay down your life for Jesus Christ. But you are a churchgoer if you have not laid down your life for Jesus Christ. It's time to know who you are. Are you a Christian or are you a churchgoer? The Bible says, listen to the Bible say, examine yourself as to whether you are in the faith. Test, examine yourself. Do you not know yourself that Jesus Christ is in you unless indeed you are disqualified? Are you disqualified? Because you're going to tell the time. People, I don't, I don't understand people. People are afraid of this coronavirus. My friend, this is not the end of life. This is the beginning of catastrophe. What is going to happen on this world? Have you read the book of Revelation? I think you should look at the book of Revelation. Look at the book of Revelation, the ninth chapter, how the Bible says all these things happen to these men, yet they did not repent. So I'm telling you, as, as a brother in Christ, have you examined yourself? It's time to know who you are in God. 
my friend, you're not just a church goer, I'm a Christian. Because a Christian is, they can encourage themselves, they can pray for themselves, they can hallelujah. My friend, I was attacked, my friend, by the devil, but I'm so glad I know how to pray. I didn't call the prayer, the prayer partner. I call on the God that's in me. The Bible said, great is he that's in me than he that's in the world. One can see a thousand and two can see a ten thousand to a flight. Know who you are in God.